Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope everybody's having a great day today. Today I wanna to share with you guys just a few things. So I have friend mail to share with you guys. I have one item that trickled in from AliExpress. I have a small Michaels haul. I have a small Dollarama haul. And then I wanna share some of my projects I've been working on for my gingerbread themed Christmas. So before I get into that, I just like to mention, like I always do, you may hear my dogs roaming in the house and my cat may make an appearance. So let's get right into this. I'm gonna start off with my friend mail. So look at this gorgeous card from my dear friend and fellow YouTuber, Crystal, and her channel is Criddlebubs. If you guys get a chance, go over and check out her channel. You will love her. She does Dollarama hauls and Dollar Trees hauls, and she is just the sweetest soul. So this is the beautiful card that she sent me 2022 isn't that beautiful and inside it reads gail may happiness fill each moment and everything you do may only good things happen for you in 2022 your friend crystal aka criddle bubs so look at that isn't that beautiful i love this card and inside she gifted me these gorgeous hearts just in time for valentine's aren't these gorgeous i love the colors in there just beautiful thank you so much crystal if you guys get a chance go over and check out her channel i guarantee you will love her so then from AliExpress, one little item, I was hoping I would have received it by Christmas. My dear friend and fellow YouTuber, Bobby, over at Bobby Joe created this by hand. Um, she made these gorgeous wreaths with these um, dies and I ordered them, but they didn't come in soon enough, but I can start working on them anytime. So this is the dies and I am all about, uh, I can't, I can't do dies that have a lot of multiple pieces in them it has to be really simple dies for me so this is perfect so if you guys get a chance also go over and check out bobby joe created this by hand not long ago i believe in the month of december she did a tutorial for uh how she put together these wreaths using these dies right here and you will love what they look like they're beautiful they're not big they're just little but just gorgeous so yeah if you guys get a chance go over and check out her channel and i can't wait to start using those so let's get into my michael's tiny little haul of course i ran back in there the other day to pick up one item and i came out with you know two bags <laughs> i didn't buy a lot but i did get a couple more things in the Christmas section but the first thing the real thing that I went in for is this uh, craft foam block that I picked up so this is the 1.25 times 9.9 .9 inches I picked this up because I was watching YouTube videos about gingerbread themed Christmases and a lot of them were doing uh, a cutout on here of a gingerbread and then they painted I'm going to show you what I created I think it's cute it's not perfect by any means because it was my first one but I want to share it with you guys I'll share it with you guys at the end of this video so yes I went in to pick up two of these to have on hand to create some of those gingerbread um, foam gingerbread men so or women whatever you want to do you can make snowmen anything just beautiful so this is and then i picked up a couple of these at michael's this is the ashland tiny treasures just the little christmas trees should i decide to decorate some more of my uh, little christmas tins that i do the shadow boxes these are adorable and they're already decorated so i picked up these now everything that i'm showing you was in the christmas except for the foam it was christmas related so these were 70 percent off so i was really happy about that these were also 70% off and I should have picked up more and I don't even know if they had any more actually. I should have looked for that. This is just the ornaments and look at, these are adorable. And I thought I'm gonna use this as a template whenever I am making some of these little gingerbread guys because they look like they're about the right, perfect size for me. So I got two of these and this was 70% off as well. I picked up two of those. I think maybe they didn't have any more, I'm not really sure. I did pick up uh, this little fella, but I didn't decorate him like that. I decorate him a little bit differently. I will show him at the end of this video as well. So it's just so cute. This was four nine or six ninety nine and seventy percent off of that. And then I really love this Christmas tree. So I think I'm going to be decorating this for um, my home, and I'm going to fill it with little like candy canes and stuff like that to go in with my gingerbread themed Christmas. Isn't this beautiful? Even if you just sat it somewhere like this, I think it is gorgeous. So I was really happy. This was $24.99 and then 70% off of that. So I was happy about that. 
So that's it for my Michaels haul, guys. <laughs> now on to my small Dollarama haul. Look at this. I was so happy that I came across this. This is just by Rama Designs, the sifter, and it holds three cups, but I was so happy to get this, you know, and it stay and put it into this whenever you're sifting it. I just think it's great. So I was really happy to come across that, and that was four dollars. I'll add that under my, I have a one whole uh, pantry is just dedicated to everything that is related to cooking for me. If my camera moves, everybody, I'm really sorry. Finley is sitting right on the leg of my camera. <laughs> I also picked up these socks. Now I'm forever picking up socks for my little grandsons because you know what? As a mom, I remember mismatched socks. Where's one pair? You can't find the other pair, the other sock for it. So I picked these up for Phoenix and this is just the little kid socks, the comfy toes. There's three pairs in there for $2.50. Sense. So I like I like those little neutral colors for Phoenix. And then I picked up these for Lincoln and River. And there's six pairs in here. They're by Hanes and they're 4T to 5T. And there's little grippers on the bottom. So I got those for the boys. So there's just multi multiple colors in here. So I think that they will love that. And mommy and daddy will appreciate that. I'm in the midst now of making their Valentine's little gifts that I put together. Not much, just a few little things. And I might in add in all of their socks to that. Oh, and I picked up a few more of these. My, I love these. So now I start bringing some to work and keeping them at work because now the girls at work love them as well. So these are just the Amadori Sesame, Sesame Crisps. These are so, so, so good. They are just really good. Either those from the Dollarama or the ones at the Dollar Tree are really, really good. Um, I also picked this up at the Dollarama and it's just these little wooden dowels because I'll be starting making some suckers soon for my gingerbread themed Christmas so for next year so I picked up some dowels for that and then I also picked up these these just uh, jumbo craft sticks to stir the uh, lightweight spackle that I have been using to do um, the icing on some of my items that I'm you know creating so I just picked up some more of those I like the bigger ones so the last thing that I picked up to make my suckers with I got my foam round rounds uh, you know to do the suckers two different sizes so i think it'll be cute but i found this at the dollarama for two dollars there's three meters on here and i thought so i got two of those of the red two of the green and then two of the white and i thought this is just perfection for the little candy cane at so lollipops that I want to make so I got those hopefully it'll work I'll show you guys once I get them done I hopefully it'll turn out really really cute give me one second guys I'm going to go get the items that I've been crafting um, for my gingerbread themed Christmas just give me one minute sorry about that guys okay so there's just uh, four things in total so the first one I'm going to show you guys is just you know the little wooden this little guy well, you can paint it up and do whatever, but I did it a little differently. I did paint this up, this color. I love this color for gingerbread. And then I just put my own twist on it, added his little, the hat was there, but I painted the little hat. And then I added, this is puffy uh, fabric paint that I used on here. And I just think it turned out really, really cute. So I'll be either hanging him in the tree or, you know, putting him in something or putting a stick on him. I'm not really, really sure what I'm doing with that. So you, you know how I showed you the foam from the dollar, uh, sorry, from Michael's. So this is what I created. I was all over on YouTube searching up, you know, foam little gingerbread guys. And I found one. This is just my own take on it. It wasn't cut out perfect and that's okay. I just think it came out really, really cute. Look at him. He is so cute. I love it. The little bow tie. I added the little candies. I put on some puffy. Uh, fabric paint on him and then his eye I just think he turned out really really cute I do love him it's my first one so I have a lot to learn but I think it turned out pretty cute so I made that one and then I made this I found another mug over at the our local uh, value village and there wasn't very many Christmas related mugs so I picked up this one and another one I haven't worked on it yet but I made this one and I think it turned out, this was a mistake actually. So what I did was a light spackle that I used. I added some white paint thinking I could make it a more brilliant white for the icing. And when I did that, I think it made it very, very um, melty almost sort of, but it turned out really nice nonetheless. I really do love it. So under here is just like a platform 
to make everything straight and it's a foam board i cut that out glued it down then i glued um, a ball of foam but half of that on the top of it and then i just ice it i just put the icing on it and when i did i noticed after i came back it started and then i added all the embellishments to it and it started to look like this but i think it turned out cute i really really do for a mistake it turned out really really cute so I added in, these are from Michael's from last year. These are little gifts that I had. Everything on here I had already. And then of course my little gingerbread guy, candy cane. And look at that. It turned out just so cute. I think it turned out adorable. I love this cup. This cup comes from Starbucks, it says, whenever I was looking at it, but it just turned out. And I think everything paired up just so beautifully together. And then this little guy's a little sticker gingerbread guy. I think it turned out pretty cute. I really, really do. I'm really happy with it, although it was a mistake, but it went the right way. So the last thing I'm gonna show you guys is just this. Now this again is my first one, so I have a lot to learn, but I think it turned out okay. Actually, I really do like it. My husband's in love with it. So it's just a little gingerbread house that I made out of cardboard. I thought, you know what? I'm gonna buy a gingerbread house, and then I thought, maybe I can make it. So again, I'm on YouTube and I found a few things that really helped me, but I made it my own. So I just, this is all cardboard. <laughs> so I just uh, put it, I cut everything out and I should have made templates for it so I could just keep cutting it out, but I'll make different sizes. It is rather large. I think I, next one I make will be a little bit smaller. So all around the white is puffy paint. And then I added these little candies that I had in my stash and I've had them for like a year or more and I'm so happy to get to use them. Added these little Christmas trees from the Dollar Tree. This is from Michael's. It's like, um, I don't know what you call it, a, a brad. I think you call that a brad. So I just stuck that in there. This is a, a bead. <laughs> And then I just stuck and glued that on there. And then this, of course, is from the Dollar Tree. And then the little candy canes that I had. I ordered this off. All of these little embellishments are from AliExpress. Then I just added puffy paint here and there. There's the side. There's the top. And there's the other side. And then there is the back. And I do think it turned out just so, so cute. It's not perfect by no means, but it is pretty cute. So that is it for today, guys. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Thank you so much for joining me, and I will see you guys soon. Bye, everybody.